be if you want it. So now we're done with this side. I'll show you guys how we do it on the other side. Yep. Jack your car up, first step. Now we're gonna take off the wheel. Once we get that wheel off. They're putting this side back together. We can show you how it's done over there. In order to access the top of the strut mount, you have to be able to, you have to remove this cover. And it has these nice little pins here. So you pop this top out of the bottom holder, then pop those loose. Get your plastic free. Shim it if you can. Yeah, find some way to get something under there. Now you can reach it and access the three bolts just inside of there. There's one, two, and three back here. Now we've got our wheel off. The next thing is we're gonna get these nuts broke loose. Then you have to hammer these bolts out because they are threaded on the sides. And then our sway bar link here. And we've got all the tools right here. So we'll tell you what you need as you go here. Real quick, grab you a 7 to 8 socket, a 5 8 socket, a 3 quarter socket, 3 quarter open and wrench, and an 8 millimeter socket. For the lugs, we used the 15 16. And then you're going to need no, a. No, 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 we used the 5 16 oh, for the lugs. 5 16 for the, the lugs. 15 16 for 15 16 for those guys. Now what you do is you take those nuts and you put them on there backwards because this won't destroy your thread. And this is how you can knock them out with the hammer. That'll do. I never knew that little trick. It's great. Don't forget to also remove your brake line before um, getting too far into this. Just like that. Those are ready. And now we're gonna take the brake line off. Little pin here. We just need gotta use that flathead, pop that loose. And then this other one should pull out. Careful. That one's a rascal. Yeah. Do you guys already loosen mm -hmm. the top of the strap? All right, so now we got that brake line done, and we also want to get this one out because these have to go into the new strut assembly. So, just like that, our brake line is free. We're going to start on that. Dad is working up here getting the top nuts loosened up. And what size does that one use, Dad? Uh, this up here is the 5.8s. That's the 5.8s up there. So we're gonna grab our eight millimeter and three quarters open and wrench here. Now you you could use a jack to support this assembly, or you could get you a coda, and a coda will use it. Will we support it. I got a jack arm. It's good for jacking. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and start seating those top ones. All right. Lift up again. So there we go. We've got that guy out. The new one in. You just pull it right out and it slips right in. Knock together here. We're tight in here, so all three of those are good. 
<laughs> the new strut is all done now. Just need a tire. Now we just need a tire. Where do you find those? Uh, Walmart, maybe? Good <laughs> You're welcome, Bill. <laughs> And there we go. That is how you can replace, remove, or install your struts on a 2013 GMC Acadia. Like nuts anywhere? Yeah, right behind you. <laughs> they don't come installed on the wheels like NASCARs? They should be. What? Come on, GMC. Just a little bit blue. <laughs> <laughs> that NASCAR ready today is Wednesday November 3rd and in our Jesus calling book it reads every time something thwarts your plans or desires use that as a reminder to communicate with me this practice has several benefits the first is obvious talking with me blesses you and strengthens your relationship hi Cohen another benefit is that disappointments instead of dragging you down are transformed into opportunities of good. This transformation removes the sting from difficult circumstances, making it possible to be joyful in the midst of adversity. Begin your practicing this discipline in all the little disappointments of life of daily life. It is often these minor setbacks that draw you away from my presence. When you reframe Re, uh, sets back, setbacks as opportunities reframe setbacks as opportunities you will find that you gain much more than you have lost it is only after much training that you can accept major losses in this positive way but it is possible to attain the perspective of the Air, Air Apostle Paul who wrote Compared to the surpassing greatness of knowing Christ Jesus, I understand everything I once treasured to be as insignificant as rubbish. <laughs>